You fuck it is, man. It's big L's in this bitch room. You dig it's bad or no? Nah. Real quick, bro. Real quick, cause we about to get straight to the base of rice. You hear me? Look, snake eyes, bro. You gotta stop what you're doing, good brother. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it a bit, but you gotta stop what you're doing, bro. Why are you? Why is you saying this man is lying about no showing? Like, I'm gonna keep it a bit with you, bro. I, I don't know what to believe. I'm not even gonna do that to Snake, bro. I, I'm not even. I'm not even gonna do that, bro. Cause I, I'm gonna keep. I do not know what to believe. I seen the IG live. I ain't watched the whole thing, but. I seen a significant portion of it. I seen like the main parts where he was walking up to the to the to the uh, desk and asking them about the ticket, and then they I guess they refused to be on camera or whatever. But even after seeing that, I still don't know what to believe. I don't know if he lied. I don't know if it was a real situation with his flight. I, like I don't know if Snake Eyes got some 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 information that the public don't got. Like I don't know. See, but I want to say this. It's, it's the boy cry wolf effect, bro. Feel me? When you lie so much, you feel me? And you no show so many people, run off with so many deposits, that when it's an actual situation, when you're really in a real situation, where you're telling the truth, it's, it's, there's no funny shit. Like, you're not running off with nobody deposit, you're not lying, your flight is really fucked up, and you're trying to, you know, you, you, this is this is what you're trying to convey to the people. They don't believe you because you know why so much. And you could be actually telling the truth. That's the crazy thing, bro. Like, cause I, if I'm if I'm reading his body language and like his facial expressions and like his conviction, he sound like he's telling the truth, bro. But I'm gonna tell you about niggas these days, and I'm not talking about you, Clean. These niggas be psychotic, bro. These niggas be real good these days, bro. For real, it, it, like we a lot of times we we just not I don't want to say discredit, but we shame women for for like lying so much. But you niggas be lying too, bro. Like people be lying with straight faces, bro. I'm talking about they be lying with conviction, like to the point where they damn near about to fight you, like like they want to swing on you because you're accusing them of lying. And the whole time they are lying. But they're trying to tell you they're telling the truth. It's like, so it's hard. It, you can't even trust people these days, bro. Because the nigga will lie with a straight face with all the conviction in the world. So I don't know. But see, but this is the after effect of taking advantage of people and telling so many lies. Like, I just think that shit is so weak, bro. And I'm not saying that's what you're doing right now, Clayton. But it's just like, bro, I'm a man like you, man. Fuck, I got to lie for. The fuck? I don't got to lie about shit, nigga. I'm taking this deposit, it is what it is. Nigga, I'm not showing up to the battle, do something. Like, you feel me? Which I'm not saying I don't understand why people lie. I'm just saying, like, when you really think about it, like, as a man, like, you really got nothing to lie about. Unless you're trying to stay out of jail. Like, you feel me? Unless you ain't trying to get locked up. Other than that, you trying to keep your bitch. But other than that, what, like, what do you got to lie about? Like, feel me? So, it's hard to gauge if clean paper is lying. Like, I don't know, bro. I hope... I hope I hope he's telling the truth because I really wanted to see this battle. But as a battle rapper, I know how shit goes, bro. You feel me? Niggas don't be prepared. You feel me? Other shit be coming up that stop people from getting right. So it's like instead of being like, listen, bro, I wasn't able to prepare. I couldn't think of nothing. I had writer's block. I only got one round and a half. You feel me? My third round a little shaky. You know what I mean? So I ain't gonna be able to do it. Let's, let's reschedule. A nigga tell a whole lot. Oh, I missed my flight. Dog ate my homework. My car broke down on the road. My niggas ain't able to bring me. It's just like, you feel me? So, I don't know, man. Hopefully they reschedule this battle. I really wanna see this battle. You know what I mean? I, I, I don't know, bro. I kinda had. I don't even know who I had. I didn't even do a prediction blog on it. I don't know, bro. I think it's any given Sunday when it comes to that battle. Even one of them niggas could have won. I like what Snake do. I like what Clean do. I just, yo, Clean just disappoints me, bro. 
Like, because this nigga had the potential to be one of the greats. I'm talking about on rock level, on Geechee level, like, on the top niggas level. Like, this nigga was so unique. This nigga was, like, so different and unorthodox and had so much charisma and talent. And, like, what, man? Clean could have been that nigga, bro. Real shit. What's up, bro? Clean could have been that nigga, bro. But he he fumbled the bag, bro. He played with his, played with his career, man. So... That's it, man. It's Big L's in this bitch. It's mad or not.